Do you notice construction over the west side? That's because Dothan is bringing more business to town. WDHN Sylvie Sparks visited a neighborhood and spoke with some concerned residents. New businesses popping up on the west side of town could cause more traffic for neighborhoods. And while growth is good for the city of Dothan, some residents are not happy having to adapt. Every time it, something develops happens, it's harder for us to get out of this particular neighborhood because we used to be able to pull out on hill on 231 and go to both directions. I have to, it takes me another 10 minutes to get out of my neighborhood to go north. A new Taco Bell is under construction on Montgomery Highway. The new fast food joint will share its backyard with a west side neighborhood. Liz Olive has lived in the neighborhood for 18 years. She says while certain businesses are convenient, traffic continues to get worse. Now it's just like development all over the place and uh, it's harder on us because they haven't taken into consideration our particular neighborhood very much, even though we're right on the 231. <laughs> Some of the residents whose homes border the new business say they are getting curtains on their windows for the first time in 40 years. While some residents are experiencing growing pains, the city says the growth is a positive thing. Hopefully this will you know, sales tax and opportunities uh, and options for our citizens to, uh, in this case, to, you know, to eat. Luckily, in, in this community, um, as we're having growth, um, we're um, not having, you know, one new business start and one shut down. I think we're having a lot more start than we have closed, which is very positive. Montgomery Highway isn't the only growing spot in town. Clearings can also be seen on Highway 84, where more businesses and an apartment building are expected to be built. Reporting in Dothan, I'm Sylvie Sparks, WDHN News for The Wiregrass. And Sylvie tells us the city hasn't revealed an expected date of completion for that construction. Earlier this school year, a number of Wiregrass schools temporarily closed on campus.